Hi everyone, welcome to my class today. In today's class, we want to look at the difference of two squares. Difference of two square. Now the question says, factorize the following. A square minus nine, question number two, 49 minus four y square. Number three is 36 minus 25 s square. Then question number four, 16 s square minus nine y square. We want to look at how we can quickly solve this in just 20, 20 seconds. Now the question one, let's start with a solution. Question one says, question one says, a square minus nine and since it's different of two square and we just want to get the answer let's see we have a square then this is equal to a square the square root of nine if you find it will be what we have three square or a square minus three a square then which is equal to a square minus three square and in order to get the difference of two square and write the final answer we have this can be written as a plus three we have a square and three square multiply by a minus three that is our answer Therefore, a square minus 9 can be rewrite as a plus 3, then into what a minus 3. So if you check, you can also check. Let's quickly check. You see, in just 10 to 20 seconds, you get you got in the answer. But let's check. Let's check by opening the bracket. Then we have a times a. It's got what? a square. Then a times 3 minus 3a. 3 times a plus 3a plus 3 times minus 3 will be minus 9. Then this one we cancel this. Therefore, we have a square minus 9. We've gotten our answer back from this. So, therefore, a square minus 9 is can be written as a plus 3 into what? a minus 3. Before we proceed to the next question, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. The subscription is just free. That is the only thing that you can do in order to help the channel so to grow. Please, thank you. Don't forget to subscribe. Then question number two. Number two. Number two, we have 49 minus... 4y square now 49 minus 4y square 49 minus 4y square the square root of 49 is 7 and 7 times 7 will give you 49 we have 7 square minus this is 2y all square can you see it's very easy 7 square will give you 49 then 2 square is equal to 4 then y square is the same thing as y square which is equal to 4 y square then this is equal to we have 7 square minus 2 y all square this can be written as this is equal to we have 7 plus 2 y multiplied by 7 minus 2 y that is the answer then if you want to check you can also check so in order to check you open the bracket you get back to this thank you question number three number three says 36 minus 25 uh, square then 36 minus 25 s square now how do we get this 36 minus 25 s square the square root of 36 is 6 6 times 6 is equal to what 36 that is we have c square c square 
minus square root of 25 is 5. 5 times 5 will give you 25. We have 5 s then all square. Very simple. This is equal to we have c square minus 5x all square. Then this can be right x c is minus 5x multiply into what? C is, sorry, this will be positive minus what? 5x. Then this can be right as 6 plus 5x then multiply by c is minus 5x. So that is the answer. Now let's get to the number 4. The last but not the least. The question number 4. Let's get our question number 4. The question number 4 says Question number 4 says Sixteen a square minus nine y square. You can see as simple as this question is. This implies that we have sixteen. The square root of sixteen is four. Then four times four will give you sixteen. That is, we have four square. Then a square minus. We have three times three. We give you nine. Uh, square root of 9 is 3. 3 times 3 will give you like 3 square, then y square. You can see now so that you can understand better. Then square is common. We have 4s all square minus 3y all square. This is equal to 4s plus 3y into 4x minus 3y that is the answer we can also check let's check to confirm if the last answer if our answer is correct then you can check by opening the bracket bracket that is 4s times 4s will be equal to what? 4 times 4, 4 is 16. S times s is equal to s squared. That is 16 s squared. Then 4s times 3y will be equal to what? Minus 12 sy. Then plus 3y times 4s will be equal to plus 12 sy. Then plus 3 y times minus 3y will be equal to what? Yeah. 9y squared minus 9y squared. Then this implies that this one will cancel this. We are left with 16 squared minus 9y squared. You can see that. And the question says the question is 16 squared minus 9y squared. If you've enjoyed the video, please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Please subscribe. Thank you.